So um, I lived in Shanghai for four years, and actually that's where I started doing yoga um, every day uh, on a, for daily practice. And then I ended up teaching yoga, and then I decided that I needed to further my yoga education, and I came. So one of my favorite teachers. Um, because I, I was looking at different kinds of yoga teacher trainings and there's like hundreds of them and you never know which one to choose. So my teacher recommended this one to me because he thought I'd be a good fit. Like I had read a little bit on the website and then like the assignments and stuff. But I didn't have too many expectations. I just thought it, it seemed like a very serious school and that's what everyone else was saying. And especially I have some friends here in Koh Samui. And they all said, yeah, this is the best school. <laughs> yeah, so I learned a lot about adjustments, because that was an area that I felt kind of lost on before. And then also, I really liked how Paul taught us about the Kriyas and the cleansing techniques and the pranayama, so the different breathing techniques. So I've done the Jala Nadi, which is or the sutra nadi, which is flossing the nose. So I do that every morning now, and I feel open, very sukha, very free. And I've done the vaman daudi, which is the, um, you drink the liter of water, and then you throw it back up in the morning. And that was also, it's good, the import, most important lesson. I would say definitely it's a lot of self-care, self-practice and repeated practice, so keeping it up every day, no matter what you do, rain or shine, happy or sad, um, having a repeated practice every single day is what is the most important thing and will get you through life. And one thing I want to mention about this course is because I've talked to other friends that have done other teacher trainings and they didn't go as in-depth especially into breathing techniques, which is very important in a lot of the other trainings. Whereas this one, um, we go in depth and we actually get to try the cleansing techniques, which a lot of teacher trainings don't do after the course. So I actually intend to teach full time. Um, maybe I will go back to Shanghai to teach full time or possibly find a job elsewhere.